Hey, this is my 2002 uh, Hardliner 16 foot camp trailer. This is going to be a video walk around and walk through of it. So, here at the front, you got standard hitch. I believe it is a 2 and 5 16 I've got the stinger and the ball with it. You have a uh, normal trailer plug on it, the lights all work on it. Single propane tank. It goes back, the only thing that runs off propane right now is the water heater, which isn't currently working. Um, this is your water heater compartment right here. I've tested it and I have propane to this point right here where it comes into the regulator. So I don't know if it's the water heater itself that needs replaced or just that regulator. So we come back here, you've got a couple compartments there that are no longer in use. That was for when it was an electric um, and gas fridge. You'll see in a minute it's only electric now. but those are not in use anymore and they're kind of sealed shut um, there's your left side tire you have a left side sewage dump on it and if you look up under here what you got you got your septic tank up under there now i may have said in the ad that axle is set a little ways back if you look at where it's centered on the trailer it puts a lot more weight on the tongue than what needs to be put on it so the trailer itself's not that heavy but the tongue weight is pretty heavy on it here's your back that back window there goes into the bathroom. Your left side, you've got a city water connection hookup right here, along with a fill to your water tank right here. Your standard step, door. Okay, so now we're inside the trailer. What you've got, I've got a toaster oven and whatnot set here because there is no electric range anymore. The counter has been replaced with vinyl tile look counter material. This is your mini fridge. It's electric. Um, it does work, stay cold, all that good stuff. You got some drawers here. On this, if you can see it, I've kind of got my bed there, but that's, um, I'll pull this up so you can see it. That's your front bed. It used to have a table there. The guy, when he remodeled it, took it out. Underneath, you've got a full spare tire and your wheel chocks along with a spare stinger and ball. The window I was talking about is right here in the front. Um, I did replace it with plexiglass. It was cheaper to get two sheets, so I've just spliced them together. That's all caulked in. Up above, you have an air conditioner. Works really, really well. Good AC in this unit. You've got a microwave sitting right there, which works. Um, to the best of my knowledge, I haven't used it to cook, but I have got it on. It works there. Um, your breaker panel right there here towards the back. You've got a space for a bunk here I'm 6'1 and it's a little cramped for me. So it's not that big of a space um, As you come back here You got your sink and whatnot as I've said I've found that the water works no leaks I can't get hot water though that hot water heater has an issue with it. You've got a uh, like a closet here beside the sink Got a little electric heater there that keeps us plenty warm as small as it is that one little space heater keeps her plenty warm this is your bathroom you've got a sink that's got a shower head coming off it your vent your toilet some assorted storage there and that's basically it